What is going on, guys? Beautiful sight here before us today. Bunch of freedom. A bunch of freedom here today on the table. We have in today's video, short little quick video, easy little video, uh, just to remind you guys, I shouldn't have to, but you know, just in case, obviously we don't like the stock plastic sights that come on Glocks, okay? They're cheesy, they're cheap, uh, they can break, they can come off the gun when you need them most. There's a lot of issues with the plastic. You drop it, it gets marred, now your sight, uh, your sight picture's all out of whack because the rear sight's shaved off or the front sight's shaved off or whatever it may be, but... If they're in good condition, good working order, like you buy a Glock and then like any normal sane person, the first thing you do is throw a set of sights on it, keep the spare sights. Don't just toss these, especially if you're into the polymer 80 thing, especially if you're into the 3D printing thing, okay? Like you're going to be getting slides, strip slides, whatever, they're not going to have any sights on them these come in handy at least it's something it'll get you by until you can afford again i like ameriglows because they're pretty much a trigicon but they save you 30 to 50 bucks i also love trigicon obviously trigicon is the name of the game but you can damn near get two sets of the ameriglow sites depending on which ones you get uh, i like the protectors those are a solid set for sure uh, for any glock defensively speaking and, uh, you know, two for one almost compared to a Trigicon, and they're using Trigicon Tritium Ampules. But either way, I'm not shilling for Meriglow. They don't know I exist. I don't get nothing for them. Uh, I just think they're a good bang for the buck, pun intended. Um, plus, I like the colorway. Look, the color is, it goes good with the scheme of all the different high-vis colors we got for the 3D printed uh, and P80 stuff, so that's cool. But, yeah, I mean, stupid, simple little thing. I'm sure a lot of you guys out there save every little piece of kit and every little box and whatever. You know, I got, I don't need this box, but I have it, you know. It's just a bunch of crap just laying around. Uh, so a lot of you guys out there probably already do this. But if you don't, you know, these are perfectly good. Like, there, I could install these onto another slide, and I will have a usable set of sights. Obviously, they're polymer. They're not going to be as sturdy or strong as steel or even aluminum. And shoving them in and out of dovetails, maybe they wear down, maybe they're loose, whatever. But in the meantime, you have something. It's free. It came with the gun that you spent six, $700 on. So if you're doing other stuff like this, you're manufacturing freedom, and you are a free man and or woman. Therefore, you don't ask permission. Um, gets expensive, especially when you got several frames you need slides for and sights for and barrels and this, that, and the third, uh, you know, reduce, reuse, recycle until you can get the good stuff. So anyway, quick little video. I appreciate you guys watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. I always love you guys participating. I love hearing what you have to say. And uh, make sure you like the video. That helps out an absolute ton. Constantly battling the uphill battle of the YouTube anti-gun algorithm. And uh, it sucks, but what are you going to do? I'm not going anywhere. They're not going to make me go anywhere. And I appreciate all and any support from you guys. But the biggest thing biggest thing of everything is your second amendment rights and so the first three links in the description box below of every single one of my videos are to help you fight for those it's a good place to start but that's not where you end you need to do it yourself people everybody has a part to play call write protest civilly disobey whatever it calls for we the people are supposed to run this country we've gotten away from that and if the second amendment goes bye-bye we've got no other rights we, we have nothing without the Second Amendment. So it's super important. It's one of the big things that I, I push and I do here on this channel is Second Amendment advocacy because it really is the end-all, be-all. Uh, it's all we have left, people. So don't let it be stripped further. Um, and let's fight to take back ground. But anyway, rant aside, uh, if you guys like what I do here, you want to support what I do here, there's plenty of options. There's 10% off with Code Terribly Tactical at Harry's Holsters, 10% off with TT10 at ShootSteel.com. And a bunch of other affiliate links and different stuff like that. But either way, the biggest thing is participation. Make sure you're subscribed. If you have been subscribed for a while, make sure you double check every now and again because YouTube has been unsubscribing people from my channel. Um, they've been, been doing it for a while, but it seems like it's been ramping up as of late. And then make sure you ring that notification bell, okay? Just ring it real good for me. Uh, hopefully, you actually even get notified. I post content all the time, almost daily, if not daily, several times a day. I'm sure you guys get sick of it. Um, but either way, let you know what I got going on, and feel free to check back. And as always, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much for being here, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.